That's just the way it is. I've also been uploading Lugie's Moogie 3 to uh, YouTube. Uh, mostly because I actually have a little bit of time right now uh, to do so. I know some people have been watching it. If you've been watching it, uh, good for you. If you're on YouTube right now, I'm impressed. Because usually when I upload stuff to YouTube, uh, people only watch the first couple of episodes. Uh, which is why there's usually not very many long-form things on YouTube. Because YouTube doesn't pay me anyway. They changed their uh, payment system right about when I got in. Uh, I literally would have reached their uh, threshold for being paid, and then they changed it the same week. So that was funny. We're missing two gems in Haunted Ghost Castle Land, uh, but I'm not really going to stress about that, right? I think uh, we can always get the thing that shows us which rooms gems are in. And kind of take advantage of that. That might be sensible. Right, it has been a weekend. So do forgive me if I forget buttons or moves or something. It's still slightly weird that X is the activation button in this game. But it's not, it's not uncomfortable though. It actually might be more comfortable than using A. Oh, that's, I feel like that's a different animation than before. I might be imagining that. The garden. Yes, we did, we did get this far beforehand. Uh, we did leave the castle before. I remember doing it. Uh, but I, uh... I, I turned my switch off. I start, I, you know, I didn't turn my switch off. I turned Luigi's Mansion off. I played some Tetris. Uh, caught red-handed. Enjoying Tetris. Oh, it's a different sim- It's a different- The little uh, elevator thing has a different symbol each floor. Jules! Thanks for the 14 months of subs. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, uh, what a surprise that a, a, a goofy yet spooky game would be your cup of tea. Um, I've been really enjoying, uh, I was talking earlier, like, I really enjoy Luigi's Mansion, but I won't be, like, super hyped to play it. But I've been hyped to stream it. You know, this is definitely a game that's just a good... It's a great stream game. There's the football. Um... Especially when you notice things that I don't, like things I can interact with, uh, which happens occasionally, and that will be very important when we're trying to get the rest of the gems uh, later. I don't know how many worlds there are in the game. I imagine the elevator probably tells us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven. So, like, around sixteen, because, like, a couple of those aren't really levels. But, you know, that's. Hopefully, it feels like enough. It's always disappointing when you, you get to an end of a game and you're like, oh, there could have been more. Um, but I guess this game has, like, multiplayer stuff that they put a lot of effort into, so maybe that. I hope this isn't a game that is cut short so that you play the multiplayer. Like some games are. Um, but I don't think that's the case. I'm, I'm not, let's not get paranoid about it. You know what I didn't do? I didn't do a lot of um, green rainbow exploration. The reason why I stream is to make people's days a little bit better. So... You just keep on having better days because of me, and we'll ha keep on having a great time. I don't do it for the cash, because God knows I don't get it. Um, excuse me. I would like to suck this. Um, 
I do it uh, to make people's days better because that's when I used to watch streams. I don't, I don't watch streams anymore. Uh, but when I used to watch streams, I watched them uh, for that kind of camaraderie and, you know, um, you know, feel a little better about it. Um... I don't really watch streams anymore. Actually, uh, it's been on my mind lately. I find so many streamers, uh, like the 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 way a lot of streamers act, I find it very unpleasant. Um, and hopefully, I avoid that. Um, even streamers I used to like, I I find very difficult to watch them now. I don't know why. Maybe it's one of those things you've I've seen too far behind the lens. Right? I know I definitely get that with, um, game- with, with games! Uh, when I work on games, I look at these environments as, like, the polygons, and the textures, and the technology and stuff. So maybe that's why I don't really enjoy actually watching streams nowadays. We're in the Breath of the Wild level, I guess? This is not what I was expecting when I, they told me there was a garden level. I kind of like that usually on a new floor there is like a little like walkway area that's like okay just chill out and hang out for a bit. Hello. I was expecting like a greenhouse. That didn't really make sense. Uh this is a little more what I was expecting. Verticality. <laughs> Don't do it Luigi. To trick. I'm gonna be careful sucking on the flowers because you can water them and we might get a watering can at some point we can drudge around the, the castle. Oh well there it is. Oh Venus flytrap monsters. We need him. Oh! Look at this dude. I'm not sucking on the flowers yet. The flowers might serve more purpose. I, I mentioned it definitely in another area, but in Luigi's Mansion 1, if you watered flowers, they would grow over time. Um... And I think that's in this game, but I'm not very sure. Okay. I like that a lot of the- like, basically the levels are all about one- one charismatic ghost villain and, uh... Oh no. Yeah. Oh no! That's pretty good. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Jesus. Property destruction with Luigi. Pineapple. There's so much, st like, We've never had an area in this game that's been so dense with stuff. I'm surprised there's nothing in that. There's a door to the next area. Neat little idea. Not against it. What's up with these? Pineapple! Pineapple! Thunder! We need to play Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga at some point. Uh, I totally forgot that Planet Zoo was coming out and I pre-ordered it. So, after we finish Luigi's Mansion, we're gonna play some Planet Zoo. But after that, I wanna play some Mario RPGs. I really do. Uh, either Superstar Saga or Paper Mario. Uh, probably Paper Mario, because I like that game more. Uh, but Mario, I, I'm in a big Mario mood lately, I guess. 
Oh, I have to suck them in order. Let's -a go. Like my my Luigi is like Luigi, but he's on antibiotics, right? He's he's not quite right, but it's good enough. Although to be fair, Luigi in this game doesn't sound quite right. What's up with these flowers? <gasps> flowers like light. I like that there's, there's, you've got like a, a, a selection of tools at your disposal in this game and you know, pretty much everything is trial and error of just what tool do I need. Although you don't use blow very often. Very rarely is blowing an option. Why did you zoom in? Oh, because... Just because. Excuse me, did I not clear this door enough for your liking? Apparently not. <gasps> oh! Neil! Secret money. I can control- oh, I can control the vacuum with motion controls! I'm doing that. That's, uh... That's actually very useful to know. You can only go up and down, but... That's actually quite useful. I'm not against when, uh, Switch games have dual... Uh, stick and motion controls. I think that works pretty well. Um, actually, that's how I used to play Splatoon. Luigi doesn't give a fuck. These guys are smart enough to dodge. Not every ghost is. Loogie, don't sneeze. The fights are starting to get pretty hard, I forgot about that. And by pretty hard I mean I'm gonna actually take damage and not be a... Big bad boss. Is that a... Is that a plot bucket? No. Pineapple. Mango. Ooh. They didn't need to do this, but they did this for us. That's a big... Buh. Buh. <laughs> That's perfectly in character. I might be getting, like, mental hay fever from all the pollen in this room. You ever get, uh... You know, I remember when Skyrim came out. There was a heat wave. And I was playing Skyrim, and I didn't feel the worst of the heat wave. Like, it didn't feel all that hot anymore. I remember that being just a, a process. The grames, grames trick your brains. Ooh. Luigi, I'm gonna need you to, uh, figure that one out. Ooh. But I think I like the soundtrack in this place. I almost like, I like when there's, like, botanical areas that, okay, it might be haunted, there might be some scary stuff going on, but, like, it's, there's a chest back there, uh, if you see that. But there's like, um... I would have liked some like orchestral kind of chill music actually. Motherfucking money. 
One of these tells the truth, one of these always lies. Excuse me. Excuse me? Aha! I was about to get royally bothered by that. Ba -da 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 -da. I want to watch West Side Story again. I feel like that's honestly a movie I could probably watch at any given time. It's severely dated. These are light flowers. Uh, but still like a good watch. Fine. <laughs> Don't villainize the pineapple, please. He did it. Bet you weren't expecting that today. Jeez. There's a violent pine. I bet you weren't expecting the pineapple to be plot relevant. I know I wasn't. But Luigi continues to surprise us! Oh, yeah, look. Dead leaves. I was thinking about dead leaves lately. For it is the season of dead leaves. And I've been clearing some up from my garden. Um, I was thinking about how you would actually do dead leaves in an autumn environment in a game. Looks like they just made them... Mm, individual assets out of, like, kind of particles and then they're on top of geometry. That makes sense. Sorry, I'm... I'm doing 3D work for my game, so I'm gonna be extra 3D game nerd lately on... on stuff. I just did that for the sake of violence. I didn't need to do that. Oh, there's a thing! I did need to do that. Okay. Thorns hurt. Lesson learned. I like how they make the end of the thorns kind of look like a the, the tied knot at the end of a rope. Because that's kind of how they've been showing it to us before. Excuse me. What? Things are so broken here. I feel like it probably serves a purpose, but I can't see it. Mm. New Twitch. Uh, dashboard is really good aside from it doesn't tell me how long I've been streaming half the time I feel like that's relevant somehow Do I need to smash the toilet? I do Oh It is relevant Things can be smashed. I don't really know what was happening, but that's what's been happening. If you like Luigi... <laughs> I was trying to go... Pina Coladas, Luigi Coladas, but I couldn't brain that. That was too much for my brain. I think I can smash that thing. No, I, I, I bet not, right? 
But it's weird they let me smash that, but there's not really seemingly much purpose. Oh, you know what? There probably is. No? No? But there's a thing back there. You s you'll see that. There's like a... Oh, it's kind of behind the cup. There's a, there's a wheel. Okay, you can just smash. Money. Okay. More than just money? Nope, just thrusts. There's some relevance to that. Look, it's shimmery shiny. Why would it be shiny if it wasn't relevant? Oh well. Ah. There's no toilet ghost. New ghost! Sneaky spooky ghost? Oh, he's, he's wiggly. You get away with one HP. You get away with one heckin' HP. He's in the mirror. Oh, that's a horrible... The noise design in this game so far has been horrible. I don't know how to beat you. Do I just suck you from behind or do I... Oh, I have to get everything off his face first, I bet. No, that's not how it go. I've beaten one of these before, and I don't remember how. Oh, well, I can remove the leaves from his face. He's just kind of hard to aim in. Hey, slashes. There we go. What? Go for the bums! There we go, you son of a bitch. You don't get to smash Luigi, Luigi smashes you, okay? <laughs> I nearly died in this room. So when it feels like something's relevant, but it isn't, usually it's a ghost. Now we know how like flowers and and uh, some of these destructible elements work. We could probably come back there when the vine's dead. We can um. Oh my god! I can't brain this. This is too much for me. I did it. I'm genius. Confirmed. There was a secret technique. Well, that curled up boy. Okay. Tall area with lots of little rooms to the side. 
pretty a-okay. Sorry, I'm taking a drink of my cherry cola. Sad and angry. You don't need to tell us why you're sad and angry, but you can be here to help me hunt some ghosts and notice things that I don't notice because I am, am dumb. For a blatant property destruction, Luigi returns! been so long wondering whether or not you could, you didn't think to wonder whether or not you should. But Luigi destroys property all the same. Just destroyed the bed. Ugh. Property destruction works. Oh, I actually needed to do this for plot. That's good to know. It's not just pure madness. That's annoying. That's annoying. It's annoying when someone basically takes their frustration out on you or. Uh, they do it as like a, um, like, well, you know, this is what it's gonna be like, so you better get used to it, which is not a good excuse. Uh, the way, like, my tutors treated uni, it's like, hey, you don't need to, you can, you can peace out whenever, you know. If you don't show up or if you don't stay or whatever, that's your fault. Never hold anywhere against my will. Hello! Oh, I'm genius! I bet there's something in the grass. I had just gone over the ability to break things, but I returned to breaking things. It's like a real life buzzsaw too, it's not like a cartoon saw. This is real life, yo. Yeah, which is not- you can't leave any time if you'd be penalized. That's different. The way my uni treated it, which I always thought was quite sensible, is- yeah, it's on you. Like, I'm not gonna punish you, whatever. But, you should be here. Look at all these melons. That's a big melon. room smelled of goo. Well, I'm sorry that your day sucked, Slashes. If it makes you feel any better, my day's been pretty good. And it's even better now! I'm playing Luigi's Mansion Gooigi time! I haven't been able to come up with a good, funny pet name for Luigi's Mansion. And that's genuinely a disappointment. 
Why am I here? Was it just for the spiders? I can plunge the melon. gonna need double trouble isn't it yeah were there rats inside that melon sorry I didn't notice that oh you shit no Ooh, baby a triple I also like how I did that fight with Gooigi while Luigi was just in a coma. I'm not a big melon man. Um, I used to hate watermelon. Now I tolerate watermelon. Um, a good a good deal of that is due to will. I'm gonna. Hope that's a reference to their love of fruit. I'm a fucking genius. No puzzle in this game I cannot solve. Melons in water. for a drop of cash. I think Luigi's Mansion 2 had the ability to actually suck up water and spray it around, but I don't think this game has that. Oh, we got a ways to go still. Like, this summer... I have had- I had some watermelon during the heat wave, and it was like, you know what, this is fine. Um, but usually I'm pretty anti-watermelon in particular. Uh, but this summer was a, a rediscovery of several refreshing summer fruits. Like, I don't usually like, um, straws, but I had some good- Had some good straws this summer. You're making it rain. I like blue plants. It looks cool. Oh, uh, Luigi ate ass. Inside every crow is three genuine American dollars. That's why they're filled with so much hate. A sneaky peek hole. Well, I, uh, this, the thing is with strawberries, right, is I love the flavor. I love the flavor of strawberries. Um, slashes. That may or may not be happening. Um, the issue with strawberries is their texture. I've, I've kind of gotten over it, but like my favorite flavor ice cream is strawberry. Um, and it used to be the case that I didn't like oh. strawberry ice cream that had real pieces of strawberry in it. But I like the flavor. Now I'm okay with it. How do I get past that? There's a big cracked wall there, I guess. 
how do I get near? Yeah, maybe we can gooey it up. I like how those birds are clearly just a guy making bird noises. No, Luigi, don't do it. It has a mouth. <laughs> oh, well, that will fucking do it, won't it? I'm in need of help. <laughs> What's, what? Where'd that come from? I have no strong feelings one way or another about breast implants, okay? All I do is encourage, no matter what, the good health. No, that's not Peg. That was a character from yesterday's D&D game. Spin. Can I? I'm a genius! So there is jumping in this game. Make it rain! I knew that'd be money. I knew it. Picture of strawberries. Okay. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the texture of strawberries. That's how it is for a lot of fruit for me. Like the flavors I'm, I'm, of fruit, I'm, I'm down to, but I'm not really into the textures. Um, I guess that's the same with breasts. I like the flavor, but not the texture. Um, okay, so I can't jump back. Uh. Well, that's the thing, Slashes, that's why I say it, because there's, there are studies that it's not necessarily good for you sometimes. The technology is always changing and evolving. Um... <laughs> Feels like there should be another mushroom in this room. Uh... The, um... Uh, brain, 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 Luigi, brain. Uh, that's why I like smoothies a lot, right? Because then you get the flavor of the good fruit, but not the gross texture. I'm aware what my characters are, Slashes. Oh, I... I get it. Maybe? Don't I get it? I kind of get it. I sort of accidentally got it. I think we're not actually that far away from, um, like, body augmentation becoming the norm. It's already starting to happen. Um, with, like, uh, ear hearing aids and stuff. They're starting to get to such a degree that, uh, some people with hearing difficulties can end up getting ears that can hear, like, better than a regular human. Um, and especially with a lot of other prosthetics and things. I'm thinking, you know, within our lifetime... We're gonna be in the era of body augmentation. It all, all it needs to do is get to the very cyberpunk point of people are starting to deliberately get body augments. Um, a, a topic that I actually plan to deal with in my game at some point. Oh no, I hear ghost. Where's Gooigi now? Where's Gooigi gone? 
Where has that mad lad gone today? So in a very Nintendo way, that starting bounce mushroom didn't actually do anything. It was only to get me to use it. Very good job, Nintendo. I know your tricks. This game actually does very good Nintendo game design. It's kind of weird because usually you think about that from a platforming perspective. But Discus does it too. Um... Watching Switch, Twitch, Twitch on mobile and 4G in general is just rough. Right, I mean, I know there's a ghost there. Well, you're gonna have to watch the VOD, I guess. They are actually, I, it wasn't always, what the heck? Is that a snake? That's a freaking snake. I thought I saw a snake earlier in this level, but I was like, no, there's no way there's snakes in this game. Don't know why. Um, but I was actually thinking about this today. Uh, there is a giant Venus, Venus flytrap. It's in the middle. It's in the middle of this map. That's that's the explanation mark. But the the idea of the topic of uh, people who deliberately um, you know they don't actually have any issue with their hands or whatever, but they get an augmented hand or something is actually a topic I mean to deal with in my game. I only thought about that idea today. I don't remember why, uh, but you know it was. Uh, there's always there's always a thing when you're, you're do doing a, a fantastical setting that has multiple races of what makes humans different and that's gonna be like one of the human trends going on how do I interact with ghost do I disrupt the sleeping bag Oh, I thought you were more important than that. I mean, like, Money Ghost is important. But I thought uh, it would be, like, a plot ghost that would... Don't get away. No escape. Well, that's, like, good, but I was, like, certain that that would be like, oh, okay, there's a ghost there, and then you have to defeat them to get past the room. But now it's just unrelated. So I'm still stuck. Feels like I need a saw, but I can't. Oh, I can climb? That? Okay. Well, that would be the the problem, I guess. That's another. That, that's that's not. Um, you know, uh, the setting for my game with comb. The, the the difference between races aren't as grand as in like D and D or something. So e everyone's horny. No exceptions. If everyone's horny, no one is. Again, I'm into the money, but I kind of need more than- I kind of need like a key or something, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's a setting that I think you'll like slashes. Um, I have just, like I said at the start of the stream, I haven't had actually much time to work on my game lately because work's been crazy. But uh, for the rest of this week, I'm probably going to have enough time. Let me just check my calendar, actually. <laughs> I've become one of those people that has to check their calendar. Yeah, the rest of the week I actually have time, so I might finally be able to get some progress. Uh, the stage of the game I'm on right now. But again, like, essential stages I need to do before I can start, like, building. 
Uh, I don't need to get the entire stuff done to build a game, but I need to have enough things there that I can add in later. Uh, I need to just get the character models ready. And uh, I, right now it's only a testing, testing models. But uh, if you don't do game art, it's kind of hard to explain how shitty rigging is. Even people who do, like, rigging for a job hate rigging. It's the worst. Ver it's, it's very difficult and not... There's fun in it. I mean, I guess that's kind of the secret cap. I'm always having fun. But it's definitely... Like, I have not been working on it because I can't really be bothered to do that. Um, but, you know... That's kind of one of the fun things about doing this mostly by myself, is that I, I've got to use all these skills that I have. <gasps> oh, I can! <clears throat> uh, no. Slashes, I'm not. Um... Erin will most likely give me the cliff notes of the things I would enjoy from it, which is nice. Uh, Erin's usually quite good about that with, like, the Eberron books and things. Like, I don't have the other Eberron book, but I know she's told me some things that, like, oh, you would be interested in this. Uh. Yeah, but, like, this is... Uh, that's just, that's just what happens when you go to university. You, you hate what your profession is. Um. My job is not rigging. <laughs> but I do know how, I did learn how at uni. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not like super fussed with the Eberron book. Before I had to, um, before I had some significant expenses, I was planning on buying the book, but I uh, removed my order. Look at this dude. Whoa! Is this a secret? No. I thought that was a secret for a second there. But the thing is with Eberron is um, a lot of the ideas for the way they do the storytelling and, and the, the, the feel of the game are, are quite useful for the games I run. Uh, I mean, I think Eren's using a couple of Eberron spells on Yuna uh, and stuff and like they fit uh, pretty well. So, University, in my opinion, is pretty much a way to learn who you are. The course you're actually doing is probably not going to be related to what you actually want to do in life. Uh, is kind of my opinion. But I'm glad I went to university because I learnt more how to learn and how I w who I want to be than uh, skills itself. No, 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 no. Good job, no. Gooigi. Now we have to go all the way back down. But that's kind of the fun thing about working on this game as like a hobby, is that all these things I learned at uni for a job, I'm now doing as a as kind of a hobby, but. It's a weird one because it's like a hobby I'm doing during work hours, right? It's when I don't have to work on anything else, I work on my game, which is good. Um, because it is work, it's it's a lot of work, whereas a lot of my hobbies are, they're still work, but they're more chill. Um, it's nice to go, oh look, I learnt these things and now I'm using them again. And I'm learning more because these skills are always relevant. But the, the main thing that I learned at uni that's been the most useful is how I manage my time and how I manage business relationships and how I manage... Ass. Is it weird that this makes me need to go to the bathroom? That's not weird, right? It has been an hour. So before what is inevitably a boss fight, I'm gonna be right back. Think about how much you want to eat the rich now.
Slashes needs to relieve his energy 